pass I don't think. All right, come back out to one of my my sites. I'll show you a quick bit of it because uh, yesterday morning I went out for a while and I was riding around some of my properties and I went down to one of them that's been really good to me and, and a couple guys I've brought over and taken to it. And uh, someone that morning had gotten out there and been digging in the field. So I got somebody night hawking on me. And uh, I can't wait to catch them either. So anyway, but yesterday that was with Wes and Carl. And this is what I found over there yesterday with them the hunting yesterday morning with the guys. Because I had to leave and go to work. This little button. It's pretty much all I found was buttons. Um can't tell that patent date thing on there but then that nice little it's like a pewter button two hole then this one this one's I gotta clean up it's got some writing around the edge of it then this here button now today I come to my place up the road here got this little stamp it says MW and company first when I dug it up I thought I had a a Bell South emblem off a pole or something, but um, I don't know. And also, found this little key right in the same little area. That, the square nail, this little tube piece, what it was, see through. And I'm finally back on the board. Got me some silver, mercury dime. I'm gonna get it home and try to clean it up a little better. Uh, can't make dates out on it, so I try, try to get it cleaned up a little bit better. She's dying near toast. Anyway, that, and I come out with a little chucky chucky with the Chucky, you got a little flat button, a uh, little baby padlock, and a nickel. And we've got a date on that nickel. 1940, pre-war. So anyway, that was it for today. So far, he's gonna go deer hunting, I'm gonna go something. I don't know what, but uh, we'll see you at the uh, Bob next hole. Thanks for watching. I got two hours to run good. Well, as y'all can see, I'm here from my old spots. Um, uh, Chuck is out over there in the corner uh, doing something. Anyway, about two inches down, I got this signal. And from the looks of it, it's a duck. That's exactly what it is. Wait a minute. That's some kind of knife. Exactly what that is. Hang on a second, let's see if I can open this up with everybody, everybody watching. I don't know if I can or not. Sure is. It's a knife. Look at that. So, a couple inches down. Give me a neat little, neat little, looks like I hit it with a shovel when I was digging it. But like, probably a nice little mallard. Well, that's a little knife. That's cool. I mean, I found the silver dime, uh, that mercury dime over at the, the Christian school, but I'm thinking uh, <laughs> this is my best find of the day. I like this. That's neat. All right, I'll get it cleaned up a little bit and uh, uh, show it to you again. And we'll see you at the bottom of the next hole. Thanks for watching. There's a little more detail on it. 
a little cleaned up. You see the mouth? That's cool. All right, we'll see you at the bottom of the next hole. All right, people, my drought is over. I'm sitting here with Big Daddy, swinging, and we're talking nine inches down in the hole. Popped out a 87, 88, 89, and I go down in the ground, and I pull it out the hole, and there it be. Nineteen fifty six silver. So, oh, two silvers a day. Um, pretty happy. <laughs> Chuck over here saying he's gonna dig his penny. <laughs> so, all right, I'll uh, see you at the bottom of the next hole. Thanks for watching. All right, everybody. Like I was saying the other day, or earlier in the video, this is what I found with uh, with Wes and Carl um, the other morning when they came over. Friday morning. Uh, it's got some writing on there. Patent number. Something, something. Patent. Something, 73. Well, nice little, little button. And this one. They're all two whole buttons. Interesting, that's aluminum. And this one. Got some writing around the edge. I haven't cleaned them up. And this little pewter button. Which is really nice. It's beat up all the heck, but hey, it's a button. It'll go on my wall. And today found this little deal over at my Christian school site this was out actually on the field that I've not got now I got permission for so that's cool MW and company I'm gonna have to look this one up see what it is square nail old key and I got a mercury dime over there and I still haven't got a date off yet nineteen say like 1915 maybe 1915 or 1913 when I post up uh, this on the uh, on my channel I'll have a better date onto it maybe I can even get a mint mark let's see That's the back of the Mercury Dome. But, not bad. Been kind of slow on the dimes lately, so, or slow on the silver, but made up for it today. All right, then, went over to uh, another school site of mine. Chuck was gonna go deer hunt this afternoon, so, got three clad quarters, three clad dimes. This nice little button that came up. Or it's a pin or something. I'm not sure. Might be a pin, might be a button. And I did get my another silver. 
1956. So, um, finally back on the board with some silver. I'm happy about that. All right, everybody. Thanks for watching, and we'll see you at the bottom next hole, as always. Thanks for watching.